Let's pretend we've done this before. Joanna says we need a run. So we gotta win these today. Let's just win runs for like a week straight. I heard you at one point, Justin. Oh shit. Yeah. I heard you at one point say that you you were kind of, but kind of not, but kind of toying with the idea of downsizing your desk. To wall mount for Oh, that's gonna get all the guitars up off the floor. The payoff would be worth it. I, I'm trying not to get like too in my head about about the subathon. I know if nothing else, Justin and I are gonna have a ton of fun. Yeah. I know if nothing else, Justin and Justin and I will have a ton of fun. Uh, but I'm trying not to get too in my head about like, oh, it's gonna be awesome, it's gonna be great, you're gonna make a fortune, you're gonna have peak viewership, you're gonna be top of category for Twitch and just chatting. Um I'm trying to be realistic about it, that it could really swing any number of different ways. Um, I don't want to build it up too much. Eh, nope, I don't want to do that room. I don't want to build it up too much. I hope we have fun. I hope, I hope we, I hope we break even. I don't know about Justin, but I'm, you know, I'm four figures in, like, not, not just for the subathon, but like, obviously, there's a lot of stuff I'm gonna reuse. Uh, I'm gonna use those cameras again. I'm gonna use, uh, you know, the streaming laptop that I'm bringing over. That was supposed to be for me for TwitchCon 2019 in Europe. So I'm gonna use all this gear again, but I, you know, I've, much like Justin, once I get excited for a thing, I, I spend money on it because I'm excited for the thing. So I'm hoping it'll be, like, I know it'll be a good time. I'm hoping we make some money. <coughs> I'm hoping we break even and make a little money, but it could also flop. So, you know, who knows? Uh, I'm just trying to keep my, keep my spirit free to it all. Sand Tiger, what's going on? Welcome. Sludge, welcome back as well. Wireless Angel, good morning. Yo, Taffy, is it possible to get that minor league Monday shirt as a tank top? Ping me in Discord and that'll remind me to ask, um, ping me in Discord and that'll remind me to ask, uh, DBH if that's possible. It's super possible. Uh, I just have to go. Like I, I would, I would prefer they go in and fiddle with the settings because they they usually do a pretty good job with it. <clears throat> I'm I'm trying to eliminate the number of things that I'm responsible for on the channel. Uh, even even if it costs me money. So I've got Joanna and Johan. I've got uh, Cletus. I've got Austin. There's definitely a part of me that knows that I need. You know what else I need? I need that. There's a part of me that knows I need all the services they're providing, but man, I'd like... On my day off, I did one half the day downstairs. We bought free guy uh, on digital copy so that the boys could watch it whenever they wanted. Um, so I watched free guy and drank coffee and, and slept in. And made myself a big beef <laughs> breakfast of pancakes, eggs, and bacon. But then as soon as that was over... As soon as that was over, um, I had to turn right back around and just start my day. And then I was just in the office until it was time to go to sleep. Uploading YouTube videos, creating thumbnails, posting socials, crafting, uh... This is the story of the newest denizen of the cave. Crafting a meal plan for the family for the week. And there is, uh... I, I could be the person who like runs my, you know, run, runs my DBH merch account, but I'm more than this happy to the let them do it. Of the newest denizen of the cave. Just wanted to ask, was the visual for the sub a little laggy? I don't know. I wasn't watching. Ah. I have gotten very good at the binding of Isaac over the years, but uh, the the release of Repentance has kept me from being able to just play it in my peripheral vision anymore. And when I'm not watching Isaac, I'm generally watching. Um, chat and not OBS which is this way you guys are over here OBS is over there and then Isaac's right down right down the barrel <clears throat> cloud swallowing man tier one for a long ass time 54 months hello chat hello uh chat folks who have put up with my ass for 54 <laughs> months somehow I feel the same way not about you but about me 
Cloud Swallowing Man, thank you for the super, super long sub. Holy Scapegoat tier 141 months. Holy Scapegoat says good morning, Taffy and chat. Good morning, Holy Scapegoat. I can feel myself, like I can feel that my respiratory system is, is winded. It's hard for me to hold an energetic monologue right now, even though like the, the, the spirit is willing, but the body feels weak. I think that's as much as we're gonna be able to get out of that sack room. I'm set up with DBH right now. You reminded me to, uh, to fix some art. DBH has always treated me super well. I um, I did work with Teespring before. I did work with Teespring. Um, D DBH treats me like I'm some sort of Twitch rock star. They treat me the same way I would imagine they'd treat like some A-list A-list celeb on their on their on their docket. Which I, you know, I'm not. I'm I am not that person. Eh. Health. Neat. Down. I got rid of it. Now we don't have to worry about it anymore. That's why I waited to take that pill. I have to go to mother, you big dumb idiot. I have to do it on the next floor. That's actually probably just like uh probably for the best. As much as I would enjoy, I think, going to Dross One. Um this, this, this is... Uh, I, I might start adopting this strategy more. If you don't feel like your run is balling out of control, don't go to Dross right off the bat. Just go to Basement 1. Or Basement 2, I mean. Tank tops are just the best for sleeping in? Will do. I'll be honest, Repentance is not on my agenda anytime soon for Isaac. I'm enjoying Afterbirth Plus a lot, though. I played Afterbirth Plus for, for years. Played Afterbirth Plus for years. Eden struck Eden streaked for years and the only time that I ever felt sad about it was when I died <clears throat> once every well if things went well once every couple of months I'd have something unfortunate happen on an Eden streak I'd be sad for about a week and then I'd get right back on the horse I feel like there's something that ha something that happens on repentance every other day that makes me not like angry but like genuinely morose Salty Sparks, good morning. Yeah, I am. I, I, mor morale is good. I feel, I feel much better. I'm just recovering from, yeah, having some sort of respiratory infection for not COVID, not strep. I, that's all I know about what it was. Not COVID, not strep. But it hit me like a hammer for a week straight. I genuinely thought for a couple of minutes. I genuinely thought for a couple of minutes that I might actually try to go to the gym this morning. I'm a little bit glad that I didn't, that I overslept my alarm. I, I think that would have been a little overly ambitious. I might give that a day or two. Um... DBH shirts are so fucking comfy, comfy of the t-shirts I bought. I prefer the DBH ones, uh, to be honest. I think I got uh, one before DBH and two from DBH. Yeah, DBH shirts are incredibly comfortable. Gizmo, what's going on, man? Oh, I could have flushed his ass. I was sitting there thinking to myself, like, I'm not going to worry about charging up flush. What are the odds it'll be brownie or dangle? I wonder if the odds of Brownie or Dangle getting creased if you have Flush. Just like, uh, you know, maybe not just like, but comparable to like when you have Book of Revelations, there's a chance you're gonna get a Horseman. Yeah, I'm not super, super shilling for DBH because frankly, I don't make very much, I don't sell enough merch to make a lot of money. It's not like, it's not like the merchandise sales are paying for, uh, it's not like the merchandise sales are paying for, um, I gotta look. I actually genuinely think that Ouija board tiers are worth it. Oh God, I almost went the wrong way. I was just not paying attention. Um, yeah, I don't make a lot of money off of merchandise. I don't sell enough to make a lot of money off of merchandise. So it's just that I like the artwork and the shirts are very comfortable. And they treat me very well there. Thank you, 64-bit robot. 
Gizmo says, not much. Glad you're feeling better. Me, me too. It was, that was, that was, uh, you know, I wasn't somebody who had to be talked into taking COVID seriously. Um, I wasn't somebody who had to be talked into taking COVID seriously, but if just a week of feeling like shit and being easily winded and coughing and hacking and not really feeling like I was being able to catch my breath, if one week of that was like, I, I just, I felt like I was a, a prisoner in my own body. Fun. I might have fucked myself. I, I, I used the key. I used the key to get into the item room. And now I need the key to go to mother. Honestly, we'd have to restart the run. I just, there's no point. Welcome to the last seven months for me. God, Ghost Cubby, I can't even fucking imagine. I need a key. Like, it's just, it's gotta be a key. Uh, I'll blow him up. Yeah! Never a doubt my mind chat planned. Planned the whole thing. <clears throat> Never a doubt in my mind. Had it under control. <coughs> <coughs> It's a weird place for the second secret room, you know? I got three of these. Hey, not bad. Pretty fly. Not bad. Luck down. Not bad. Um. <coughs> I am still a little raspy. <clears throat> when are we getting tappy calculated? I will say I got I got my I got my propaganda shirt t-shirt. I love this one. I've never had this one before. There are a handful of my shirts. Uh, there are a handful of my shirts that I've never owned. So I finally have uh, I finally have uh, one of my little propaganda. The good one. I don't, the other one glitch likes, but I don't. Of the two propaganda tees, I prefer this one. <clears throat> Murder. I'll be interested to see whether or not, uh, I'll be, be interested, interested to see whether or not little, little, little dumpy buddy. Is any good with BFF? Fuck you, play bad, get rewarded is amazing. I'm glad. I was too close to that one. I was too close to that one. Um, if you guys don't know, the play bad, get rewarded one is the propaganda poster with a soldier who is just chock full of bullet holes. But he's got a chest full of medals and looks super proud of himself. And that is pretty on par with what I asked for. The problem was is that like Sorry. Uh loud, loudest rooms in all of video games, you know how it goes. Um I asked this Australian designer based on some propaganda uh, poster artwork that he had done. I went and found him on Behance, and the work that he had done was pretty spot on. It was it was almost exactly what I wanted. And he, he did mock-ups. He did pencil sketches. And the pencil sketches looked really, really good. Damn, I was hoping to get that blue that blue fire. The pencil sketches he did were really good. And then when he when he finally like uh pieced it all together and and made it. It had, like, first of all, I gave him, like, six weeks. Shit, man, I may not have the keys for this. I may not have the keys for any of this. Huh. I'm gonna be able to get one more bomb, so let's see what this does for me. That's a lot of bombs. When he finally pulled it together, it, it, it wasn't... 
what Glitch is wearing. What Glitch is wearing was patched up by my buddy Evan. I took it to Evan and said, Evan, I paid this Australian designer 600 bucks for this shirt design. Because back in, back in those days, I used to make a lot more money off of merchandise. I think it was just because the merch was new. We didn't have nearly as many viewers, but the people who were with me were like real ride or die that I was going to become a full-time Twitch streamer. Um... So when I showed it to Evan, I was like, I gave this dude 600 bucks and six weeks, and this is what he came up with. And Evan was like, oh, this is not great. And I was like, yeah, tell me about it. This is not great, right? Sorry, if that spider had touched me, I'd be dead. Um, so Evan took a pass at it and cleaned it up and kind of made it into the respectable shirt that Glitch bought. I don't know where the secret room is but he did that for me as a friend like he didn't he didn't even take money for that yeah we failed successfully I, I there, there's definitely a part of me that has a, a a bad association with my experience with the artist on that one he did awesome line work in pencil he did an awesome, awesome pencil sketch, sent it to me, and then put me on the back burner for like five and a half weeks out of the six week deadline. And then literally overnight dumped that on my plate. And I was like, I feel like you just half-assed this to get it finished. I feel like you let me slide because I was the most mellow of your clients. And because I was the most mellow of your clients, uh, you, were, you were more than happy to let me kind of fall by the wayside. I need keys. What made it so bad on the first pass? Well, the... I just get super nervous in that room. If I remember correctly, there's another room like that coming up. Yeah, this one's not great either. <clears throat> I wonder if I could go find the old the old pencil drawing. The old pencil drawing was like... The, the sketch had a lot more shading. Uh, it was... It, the, the, de the detail work on it was really good. Like it, it looked like a prop, like it looked like a sort of cartoonified propaganda poster, but it looked more propaganda poster than cartoon. So fucking loud, man. This is the story of the newest denizen of the cave. It. Oh, that's bad. Just hide, just hide, just hide, just hide. Um, when I got it, instead of having any sort of like real gr gritty aged texture to it, in instead of having like a, in video, in video terms, it'd be like static, like scratches or distressing. Instead of having any shading whatsoever, it was like just a full blown, it was as though he'd gone in on a on a on a Wacom tablet, inked his sketch into an outline. Imagine somebody sent you a graphite sketch in pencil, and there's like all sorts of shading and cross hatching and stuff like that. And then what you got is like that incredibly basic that incredibly basic like black stroke uh, with liquid fill tacky gas station Christmas ornament. Let's see. I'm trying to see if I can find one, like what I'm thinking about. Ah, st stupid Google search for Christmas ornaments is only returning like nice ones. But you know what I mean? Like the kind of Christmas ornament that like your kid would make for you at school. I wonder gotta flush him, right? It doesn't flush him? The dude's called Turdlet! Edmund, how could you phone this in like this? You have forgotten the face of your ancestors, Edmund. Yeah, flat coloring. It was like he went in and he made an outline of his, of his work. Like the most basic black outline that he could. And then he just used the MS... He just used the MS Paint Fill Tool. After that is what it felt like. It it felt like he just used the MS Paint fill fill tool and called it a day. 
There was no shading. There was no gradients. I had to go to Evan. I think there's a starburst in the background of that one. I had to go to Evan and ask him to put that starburst in just so there'd have some sort of like uh, a... <clears throat> just so there'd be some sort of like texture to it. Amy Monster, tier 1, 22 months. Thanks to Framery for my gifted sub party on Framery. Amy Monster, welcome back. I'd be pretty interested to see the original about giving uh, subpar work so that the, that whole sentiment made my stress boil. I'll, 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 <coughs> I'll give it a pass later <clears throat> and I'll see if I can find it. I'm gonna go to the shop first and hope against hope I can get a key from in there. Watch this be terrible, too. That is not terrible. That is not terrible. I've seen a lot of Jacob's Ladder in the last week. <laughs> Damn, Taffy cursing in Dark Tower. This lobstrosity over here. Um, Torrin, what's going on, dude? You've been scammed. Uh, you know what sucks bang on head is that I I had seen his work before. He had a, a lovely... He had a lovely Behance profile, which is not me talking in some sort of weird grinder slang. Um, Behance is... It's like LinkedIn, but made by Adobe for graphic designers and illustrators and all that jazz. Basically, like if you're in if you're in graphic design or advertising, Behance is uh, Behance is a, a LinkedIn where you can show off your work. Behance is awesome, even if you just like art. Behance is just a cool place to go and see art that other people are doing for money. And so I'd seen his work. I like I sought him down. I basically went into this Behance website. And I searched propaganda poster because obviously there's a lot of like video games and companies and uh, so loud. There's a lot of video games and companies, uh, you know, clothing companies and and what whatever, right? There's a lot of companies that use fake propaganda posters in their advertising. Certainly a lot of video games. I'm gonna do it. But it's because I'm going to get another deal with the devil at some point. I have to believe. And I'm going to wish that I had the health to spend. I'm going to need a tears upgrade like yesterday. Um. So yeah, I'd seen the dude's work before. I really, really liked it. I only, I only approach artists whose work I have already vetted and enjoyed. But it really just felt like he didn't spend any... Like, he spent a lot of time on the sketch to make sure I didn't, like, pull out of the deal. And then he waited until the last minute. When I gave him a month and a half to work on it, it felt like he waited until the last minute to finally hand me something. And when he did, it didn't look like he had given it any real effort. Oh god, you're still alive? If it's Adobe, does it cost 25 bu mu Uh, I don't know. I already pay for Adobe because I need it for the YouTube channel and for social media posts and for occasionally editing my own videos. And then before this, I had Adobe because of my time with uh, 99 Lives and Pretzel. I did a lot of... Um, I ended up doing a lot of stuff for 99 Lives and Pretzel that required me to, to hop on and deal with that. I'm exhausted and I have no idea why. Sorry to hear it, Torn. I use GIMP and Inkspace myself. I'm not that well advanced. Oh, I've... I, I, I learned what I learned out of necessity. I learned what I learned out of necessity so that I could work on YouTube and Twitch stuff. Which meant it was really funny when I went to graduate school. Nope, fuck that room. 
when I went to graduate school, I just gotta turn the whole game down. When I went to graduate school, I was more advanced with regards to like Adobe Suite and Photoshop and Premiere than the students who were like dedicated art directors. Just because I had already been using it, <clears throat> I had already been using it for Twitch, Twitch and YouTube. So that was actually pretty cool. Like the stuff that Rob and I had learned together that Rob had taught me uh, came in very handy in graduate school. Yo, I will absolutely take more keys, thank you. I'm curious now whether or not I have the old, I, I, I'm willing to bet that if I have an old copy of the of the t-shirt the design that I didn't like and the sketches, it'd probably be in my email. I'm willing to bet I could probably drag that out from years and years ago on, on just my old personal Gmail account. Oh, that wasn't Noah. Shit. I, like, listen, I love Noah to death, but the scooper get out of here i should have taken what was that micro cells or whatever what terrible items those were um yeah i love noah to death but noah i don't think is the kind of guy who can learn accounting software in a weekend that was nate nate did that nate on the other hand <clears throat> nate on the other hand is 100 percent the kind of person who takes a weekend and just learns how the how the just learns over the course of the weekend how uh, bookkeeping software works and then teaches himself how to reverse engineer it and trick it so that it thinks he's an accountant so he can do whatever he wants. Shot speed up. Ah, uh, too forgetful. Welcome back. I'm sorry the vacation's over. Used to work for the Intuit help desk? No kidding. I had, I had to leave QuickBooks. I, I couldn't make it work. I felt like QuickBooks kept trying to help me when I didn't need help. Why is this room the way it is? I constantly felt like QuickBooks was trying to like solve problems for me that I didn't have. So I switched to zero for bookkeeping software and it's been, it gets, it gets out of its own way. Like zero only really ever does what I tell it to do and nothing extra. Almost done? Almost done. Wait, nope, not almost done. I didn't realize that dude was still up there. Dude, I wouldn't mind getting- Oh my god, you're still up here too. I wouldn't mind getting birthright now that we got BFF. We got BFF, uh... I feel like that- I feel like that dude- I feel like that dude died because he's- Like he spawned inside me. I can't take any of those in case it's telepills. Oh my. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. Health up. It cost me nothing. I'm excited. I hope that fades by the time the next floor gets here. I'll tell you what, the rock station's not doing it for me today either. No, 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 not that one. Uh, let's do Synthwave. Yeah, rock station's not cutting it for me either. Being audibly overwhelmed is not on my agenda today. 
Which means I should probably not do any more mother runs, but we gotta unlock what we gotta unlock, I suppose. I have regen. Neat. Kinda neat. Neat until I accidentally knock myself out of Horror Babylon mode. Some smooth jazz. There's a jazz station. I'm terrified that it won't have the... I need something with a little juice. I need something with a little juice to get me going because it is Monday and I have been sick for a week. So I do feel like I need a little pick-me-up. I'm terrified that jazz will just put me to sleep. In a good way. I love jazz. Well, I don't want to sit here and like profane like I'm some sort of like fucking huge jazz aficionado. I, I kind of just don't want to fuck with this. It feels like more trouble than it's worth. I very casually enjoy jazz. I'd be very, very honest about my fan standing. I very casually enjoy jazz. I don't understand why I got hit there. I guess I walked into the fire. I'm much faster than I'd like to be. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm terrified that jazz won't have the, won't have the kick that I need. I was toying with the idea of just having the horror channel on. Because if we're being honest with ourselves, this is the scary game today. Resident Evil Village may have werewolves and big booba vampire mommies. Uh, but this is the, this is truly the scary game of the two. Yeah, Synth Wave I think has got like the nice has got nice ups and downs and and peaks and valleys without being too soft or too aggressive. do pretty desperately need another tears upgrade. <sighs> I have to remind myself there are good items too, right? I'm also trying to remind myself whether or not I'm also trying to remind myself whether or not um, there are good items that I haven't unlocked yet. I genuinely can't remember if there are good items that I've just not unlocked yet. We can go back to the spookies. Sure, drop me two or three hundred bucks and I'll switch to spookies right now. Two or three hundred bucks and I'll go up to Joanna and just tell her that she's got to figure out something to post on the YouTube channel today. That it's not my problem. Because she literally came in here today and said, please win a run or two for me today so I have something to post. Hey man, those are bits. Here is a percent of the two hundred dollars. Thank you for that one one hundredth of our goal. Torin, you're too kind. Two or three hundred bucks is a bargain too. Well, there's a part of me, Wireless Angel, that wants to put an asterisk on that and say, if you've got, if you've got a one million bit bit badge, that 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 deal doesn't apply to you. That deal is exclusively tailored uh, for Darth Shield, because I know Glitch is here, and I don't want him to hear that and get any fucking wise ideas. That deal is uh, void where prohibited. Some restrictions may apply. I realized when I said that out loud that there were people who would definitely do that just to watch me sweat.
the new YouTube channel has uh, has avatars now. I'm gonna I'm gonna pimp it on social media today after we're done here. Got to pimp it on social media after we're done here today. I'm excited. I, I I just wanted all the pieces to be in place. I didn't like that I was reusing assets from the cave. It just made it look like somebody had stolen my channel. Fuck, I button mashed the wrong direction. In my defense, it's kind of hard to see. It's a dime, huh? I guess. Hey man, those are bits. Dark Shield with 100 bits. He said my name, so I must give him the monies one dollar at a time. Thank you, Dark Shield. I appreciate that. I am a little bit bummed out. I, I was hoping I was going to be able to maintain vocal energy a little bit better than this. <clears throat> I don't feel as weak as I've felt over the last week. Uh, but I do feel winded. Like, instantly winded. Because I, I haven't really had to talk in like, a, in like 36 hours. Is there a secret room somewhere? I don't know where the secret room is. I guess I'll check the second secret room. That's not it, huh? Well, holy shit, now I'm really curious. <laughs> Need that new banner on a t-shirt? Well, it's not there. Maybe there? No. It's not there. You can check here for free. And so we will. That's probably better for me. I like Guppy's head quite a bit, but whoops, not what I meant to do. I love Guppy's head quite a bit, but I actually feel like to keep our red heart off of us and to potentially be able to summon dead bird whenever we want to. I think we I think we take the IV bag with us. Plus, we we can keep all the money from these runs. Like we can do 999 cents if we want. The tough wins. Excuse me. I will say Jacob's ladder is nice here because it means I don't have to hit anything. I don't have to hit anything, I just have to hit walls near stuff. Oh my god in heaven, are you serious right now, my guy? You're gonna make me come over here and prove my affection to you? And then as soon as I do, you're gonna go over there? You big coward? hurt myself hate it all right chat very quietly my alarm went off so I got to take a little stand-up break <laughs> that's me to myself I guess that's not what I meant to click works though <clears throat> Ew. Ew. Well, hold on. Shit. A lot of time spent here. There we go. Jackpot, what's going on? Fun. I couldn't possibly take a uh, shard of glass right now. Well, I fixed my tears. My rate of fire is, is salt. We, I, with Jacob's ladder, this might not be so bad. With Guppy, it'll be fucking great, I think.
If we can pick up Guppy, I feel like we'll be great. What about almond milk? I'd rather have almond milk than shard of glass right now. For sure. This run's suddenly gonna take a minute. I have to murder you, friend. I'm sorry. It's not personal. Again, thank God for Jacob's Ladder. It's the only thing allowing me to make contact with a whole lot of these enemies. I have self, what's going on? Welcome back. Yeah, that Ninja Blender that Rusty Brazen Fire sent me as a gift is super sexy. <clears throat> I don't even feel like my tears are all that high. I think it's just because like Tractor Beam would be insane. Tractor Beam would be so good. It's just because they don't shoot in a straight line. So it doesn't really feel as though I'm putting shots on targets. It feels like I'm putting shots roughly around targets, which is not the same and does not feel good. Yeah, we've got a couple of animated emotes. We're going to keep going with those. I've got to square up with uh, Thermal this week. He's, he's done a, a lot of work for us in the last couple of months. I want to pay him so he feels incentivized to continue to do more because it's all, it's all good. It's all really good. Oh, God damn it. Okay, hold on. Boy, I hate how involved this room is. I definitely want that. I mean, I'll, I'll clear the shop out. I, I'm half tempted to take deck of cards. Judgment. Except I really need to get out of here with the ability to drain my health. That's a weird sound clip I wish we had on deck again. Thank God for Jacob's Ladder. Ah, it's the same thing with, like, uh, the Cancer Trinket. Thank God for Cancer. Happens a lot in this game. Thank God I found Cancer. Is that <clears throat> basically it for this floor? I owe it to myself to find the second secret room. I absolutely should. We're gonna try our best to get this guy to pay out as well. Ooh, growth hormones. Feels all right, man. Oh my god. Demon beggar, my guy. Talk to me. What can I do to make you love me? I have regen too, so as I'm going around, I might even be able to top off a little bit. There's no reason why I can't get this beggar to pay out no matter what. Yeah. Again, I wish I could get a deal with the devil. Oh god, what have I done? I wish I could get a deal with the devil. I wish I could get a deal with the devil to force the game to take my health away. I mean, I could just use this health down pill, but I, it's not going to get me all the way there, so I don't think it's worth it. I don't know yet about that. I would love the fortune... Or sorry, not the fortune teller. I would love the uh, crystal ball. Fuck, man. I, don't, I Like, I sometimes forget what their attacks are. Because I'm still... I don't want to say I'm new to this area, but I don't do like the I don't do the mother route every time. That's clearly not it. What was down here? We're in the actual hell. Where in the actual hell is our uh, second secret room? Here, maybe? 
Huh. <clears throat> I'm half tempted to blow all these things off there. Well, I guess I can't. Something allows me to. I can't remember what it was. <clears throat> oh, is it there? I don't think I tried there. Anchi Maya, what's going on? Greetings and salutations. Did I just do this wrong? Chat, where am I not seeing it? Make me understand. That's not what I was hoping for, but I'm glad I got it. Let's get weird. Let's get weird. How are y'all doing? Recovering. Recovering. I, I was genuinely hoping I was uh, completely turned around off this whole illness thing. And I, I'm not sick anymore. I'm not sick anymore, but I'm still, oh my. I'm still trying to, like my, my, my respiratory system is uh, not at a hundred percent. I can still feel myself like trying to clear, clear. Is there, okay, first of all, oh my God. I was gonna say, is there a thing that opens these up? And as it turns out, there is. You just have to guess correctly, I suppose. A lot of health out of that. So yeah, like I'm, I'm, uh, I'm feeling better, but my body's still processing out all the ick. I thought I might go to the gym this morning, and I, I was telling Amber that that I'm realizing how overly ambitious that was. That's cute that I thought I was going to the gym, but I thought I was going to the gym this morning. I overslept because my body, like when I told my body it might be time to get up at, at pre-dawn AM, it was like a revolt. Like the inside of my body was just like, you're out of your fucking mind, cracker. If you think I'm getting out of this fucking bed at 5.30 in the morning. And then I didn't get up until almost 8. My body like took 9 hours of sleep. Like it didn't ask for sleep. It took 9 hours of sleep away from me. The perfect number, perfect number of coins. If, if I'm being honest, uh, you know what? I'm I'm a little bit nervous about health, so I'm gonna go ahead and play this. I'm gonna go ahead and play this out, and see if I can get some soul hearts. So far, so good. Well, we're 20 coins in and we've gotten two two bad trinkets two bad trinkets and uh, a, a card of indis uh, undiscerned value nice a duplicate card and two mediocre trinkets for half our money and a lot of a lot of copy a lot of snarky copy ooh shit Yeah, you know, Nail, it's been fun. But the crystal ball is mapping, and when it pays out with a soul heart, it pays out with an entire soul heart, you know? You try your best. There's that tears upgrade, honestly. I don't know that I would have gone so gung-ho. I don't know that I would have gone so gung-ho on a lot of the stuff I went gung-ho on if I had gotten this before uh, picking up soy milk. Oh well. Ugh. You try so hard and you get so far, but in the end, in the end it doesn't really matter. Actual, actually faster to not try to get to the kill switch and just and just kill them with our shots. 
remember once upon a time chat when I said that runs felt like they were way more fun and we could make more cool shit and we just hadn't been able to in a long time? These are the kinds of runs I'm talking about. These are the kinds of fun runs I'm talking about. I feel like we don't get these nearly as often as we used to, but damn, when we when they show up, they reaffirm the love I have for this game when it will let me. When this game will allow me to love it. Runs like this happen and I am filled with joy. A lot of different spots the second secret room could be so I'm not gonna pop off on that until I have some sort of clarification I think bananas b-a-n-a-n-a-s it's gonna breeze on through for the moment nice I think I take the guaranteed damage upgrade. I'm glad I turned the game volume down. This would be unbearably loud. If I hadn't turned the entirety of the game volume down a little bit. We initially did it for Dross because that whole level is just loud water and louder louder lava. I guess not, that's not... Dross isn't lava, but you know what I mean. That feels like it's it. I lied. That's not it. Tented Rocks seem to be at a premium, which is a little bit of a bummer. Alright, that seems like it. There we go. Sure. I have no idea. Blowing up the key guy doesn't give me any, any increased chance for a deal, does it? I don't think that it does. I'm gonna find out though, it's not as though I have a whole bunch of extra keys uh, to, to get rid of anyway. Nah, it doesn't. My man did give me some keys, though, and for that I'm grateful. Come on, Mom, let's get it done. El Pablo, what's going on? B. Perry, welcome as well. Do damage. Sadly, no... No deal with the angel, or sorry, no deal with the devil. I don't know that we need one so long as crystal. Okay. So long. Okay. Dumpy, you're really fucking with me here a little bit. I'm not gonna lie to you. Kind of, kind of the whole point is that I can memorize the patterns of these things and you are blowing them all over hell and gone. I can't remember if I got deals with the devil coming. I think I do. I think I have at least one more potentially coming. Oh, I can see. So good. Yeah, I might as well go go ahead and donate. Dono machines right on the border between healthy and healthy and lean. Damn. genuinely feel a desire to get rid of these um, red hearts in a pretty bad way. I kind of want to safeguard these soul hearts, so I don't know that I'll go into that curse room. Lots of keys. Feels good normally, but I don't think I'm gonna have any use for it. Like, I can't think of any situations really where... Hello? 
I'd love to go explore the other side of the room, but the game prohibits me. It's too late to come back now. Shot speed down. That's not great. Man. I tell you what. If this boy pays out. If you're not going to be able to get rid of the red hearts, you got to lean into them. I don't think I'll be able to, like, if there's a, if there's two, two, if there's a deal with the devil with two red hearts, I will feel appropriately penitent for having done what I just did. But I'm, I'm officially banking on, I won't have the ability to get rid of two red hearts. Spin two bombs, get three. I'm willing to bet that there's no way I get rid of these red hearts. So I might as well just lean into having health. I'll hold off on this charge until the next floor. Chimera! I feel a little bit bad that there's literally no way to dodge me right now I always like kind of picture Chimera as being controlled by a computer player and that this version of Isaac walks in and the computer player for Chimera goes what the fuck is this all about like what am I supposed to do here well shit uh, we have things we have to do hold on take the chariot card in here well I mean good news bad news I would have been able to get rid of these red hearts More good news is that I Shit. picked up a Joker card, so I get to deal with the devil on the next floor as well. I still may be able to get rid of these red hearts. The bad news is I didn't take the Polaroid, so I don't have Polaroid invincibility. I don't want to get into a situation where we're creating a bullet hell, but we're also creating a place where it's difficult to see our shots. It's difficult to differentiate between our shots and enemy shots, so when we get into the mother fight... I'm gonna have wee issues because it is uh, very busy on screen right now. Still confused as to why you'd want to get rid of red hearts? <clears throat> well, if I get rid of all my red hearts, if I get rid of all my red hearts, then I get the negative effect every time I get hit, which is the uh, that Necronomicon pop, which is cool. But additionally, I get Horror of Babylon, which is a damage increase. So I get two benefits compared to the negative, which is just not having red heart health. But if I can fill it up with soul, soul heart health, um, then, the, then it's very clearly, like, uh, very, like, very clinically clear, very technically clear, um, clearly beneficial. To have soul hearts and no red hearts. Whew. Yeah, sorry, Chad. I'm winded. I'm still winded. Law Thriller, good morning. Just pop this whenever, I suppose. Now's as, as good a time as any. Oh my god. Well. The game met us halfway. We don't have all of our red hearts gone, but we do have Horror Babylon, and now we have Guppy as well. Don't mind if I do, Woo. And we got an Emperor's card hitting the floor. Which means that for this boss fight, we are going to have increased damage output. I'd like, to say, I'd like to think that we're pretty well sorted. I'd like to believe that we're pretty well sorted. I 
I feel like I almost never get flight anymore, so it's nice having Guppy if for no other reason than I just have flight, and that feels really, really good. I'm not going in the curse room. If I knew for a fact there was... Well, shit. If I knew for a fact there was an item in there, it'd be easier for me to go in and do this. I'm excited. Burp. Is that another shot speed down? Hell yeah. All right, that, that's kind of why I didn't want to go in there. I talked myself into it. I wish I hadn't. They may have reduced the spawn rate for flies on Guppy, but when your rate of fire is 20, uh, it really doesn't matter anymore. You still, you create flies like the old days. You create flies like the old days when you're uh, when you're shooting at a rate of tw 20 tiers. Oh my, that's super good. Oops, I don't know why I tried there. Last second nose goblin. Which means we're gonna be sticking a million little boogers on all of our enemies. There we go. I gotta wait for it to stop, there we go. I'm okay. Down we go. Foreign Empress don't stack? Uh, you don't stack. The whole damn system doesn't stack. Did I have a better option? Yeah, Resident Evil. Resident Evil after Isaac today. At lunchtime, or maybe even a little bit earlier if we get like two or three really good, relatively fast runs in. I didn't see which side it was. I picked wrong. I have chosen poorly.